hand boiler is an interesting thing. This again is a store-bought thing. They come in different colors. I think I paid maybe 10 bucks for this. No, actually $5.99. So $5.99 at some place like Hobby Lobby, Michael's, one of those places. Obviously you can order things like that offline as well. Uh, but for, for six bucks, this is sort of an interesting thing. This has to do with Charles's Law. And again, you can look up Charles's Law. But uh, Charles's Law says that uh, the state that a gas's volume has is proportionate to its absolute temperature. In other words, as the temperature of a gas increases, so does the amount of space it takes up. Again, that goes back to the things that we've talked about where temperature affects so many things and we've done several experiments about how hot and cold make a difference. Uh, so inside this little hand boiler, uh, which is at a constant temperature, obviously that's why it's all uh, in one piece, uh, the heart of um, uh, the, the thing, which is down here at the bottom, um, the heat from my hand will cause the gas uh, to expand enough to displace the liquid. So it's going to move the liquid up the tube as I hold it. And obviously if I put my hand all the way around it, You'll notice that it boils, or not boils actually, but it looks like it's boiling because all of that gas is displacing the liquid and causing it to, to move. Now, if I take my hand off and the temperature begins to decrease, you'll notice that all of the liquid will go back down to the bottom of the tube and you can go it, do it over and over and over again. So uh, Charles's Law, which is a, a different phenomenon than some of the things that we've talked about, and how temperature affects different things.